My name is Yasa Manija from the Mindfulness Center, and we're going to be interviewing. We have a quick question we wanted to know. Our mind-body practices, how are they affecting our health now, our genes, and the way that we age? Basically, most people think of medicine as only surgery and pharmaceuticals. But 60 to 90 percent of visits to doctors are in the mind-body stress-related realm, poorly treated by drugs or surgeries. This is where mind-body can have an enormous effect. People have gone different directions, but finally, with a scientific base, we have shown that the mind can evoke a, a, a uh, reaction that's opposite to that of stress, and that's called the relaxation response. And that is evermore becoming a part of medicine, affecting what could be a truly balanced form of medicine where we use drugs, surgeries, along with self-care. And in that self-care realm, we have the relaxation response. Okay. And in regards to self-care, how do you see the mind-body sciences affecting preventative care? Yes. Um, throughout our lives, we're subject to stress. And that stress can often kick into physical illnesses when we overload our system from stress. We burn out. And now we believe at our institute, or Benson Henry Institute for Mind-Body Medicine at Mass General, that p children should be taught these approaches early in life as preventative. We set up an educational initiative for that very purpose. And we what is that initiative called? Educational Initiative under the aegis of Marilyn Wilshire, W-Y-L-C-H-E-R. And she trains teachers for this, and we have wonderful results helping kids with stress and setting up a lifelong pattern. Furthermore, by teaching this in medical school, now as we are doing, it's getting into medicine in general, so a physician, a nurse, uh, wouldn't necessarily think of only drugs or surgeries, but how we can use mind-body processes as well. Um, we wanted to know, what do you see as the biggest problems in healthcare, and how can we solve them? Biggest, I believe, major problems in healthcare today are the excessive expense that we are uh, generating and caring for people. Too many drugs, too much surgery, but they're vital. We have to bring about a proper balance and by taking stress out of that formula, <clears throat> I think we can make things much more affordable, more efficient, and effective so that people could help themselves with self-care. Thank you, Dr. Benson. Dr. Benson is our keynote speaker today at Mind Body Week, October 2011. Thank you so much. Thank you.